Hello and welcome to my channel. Well, I just had 99, 892. I just replaced my oil, pulled the filter, and I'm gonna show you guys what I found in the filter. So basically, 100,000 2012 Toyota Sequoia. And what I see in the filter, I just not sure how to explain. Maybe some of you guys can comment and see what if we can come up to come up with a good answer explanation. So I had the filter wrapped in multiple paper towels to absorb all the oil so I can see what's inside my filter. See? Carbon buildup. Why? Look at the chunks. Look at the stuff inside there. More here. Look at the bigger chunks. Why is it? Well, I bought the car used. It was two years old. See where there is, you can actually see. Why? Like I said, I bought the used the car. It was two, two and a half years old. This SUV with less than 36,000 miles, somewhere between 30 and 36, according to the service record, was maintained by the dealer, uh, one in North Carolina and one in somewhere in Florida because car was constantly on the road and to location of the service. It was a dealer vehicle. So did they either they never changed the oil or the oil they used uh, left behind a lot of a lot of byproducts that now 70 80 thousand 70 thousand later it's been still removed. It's amazing how much stuff still being trapped. So 10 years later, that's why it pays to use high detergent oil. Look at that stuff. It's amazing, isn't it? how much is being trapped. Imagine if filter did not trap this stuff and it was circulating and causing a lot of damage to the bearings, timing chain, oil pump, and everything else. Look how much stuff there is. Amazing. My question to you, are you using high detergent oil? Or are you using just okay? Are you planning to keep your car for the next 20, 30 years? or you wanna keep it for a short time and get rid of it. Amazing, see? If it wasn't for the filter, quality filter, this would have been circulated and caused a lot of damage. Because big stuff is not just causes the damage, it, it's either the by byproducts that are being trapped by the filter or during the combustion, or it's the byproduct left by low quality oil by the previous owner from changing it. Because if you start with the oil that it's not pure, well, it has impurities. Guess what? What happens with impurities? They are being, they will stick to the engine components and they will clog up passages and such because it's not pure. When you start with a pure oil, well, then it's pure. There is nothing in it, you know what I mean? It's pure oil. So, wanna thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video with others.